everybody. Welcome back to another segment on Man Cave Collectibles. I'm Jonathan. I'm Jose. So uh, we're filming today our pickups. This is what we picked up this week. Um, it's a wide variety of different things. Definitely a wide variety. Um, it is something that uh, there's a pop in here that we tried getting when Comic Con came out and we weren't able to. Hence, um, spoiler alert. But let's get into it. Here we got the Surf Up Joker. Um, it's like the, the original 1966 Joker pop that they made before, but it's from that one episode. Uh, I think it was the episode was called Surf's Up, where Joker and Batman do like a little surfing competition and just like old school Batman esque uh, Joker style. Um, what I like about this one, he's identical to the the original 1966 pop, but he has the surfboard, his little swim trunks. The cool thing about that is the mustache, guys. Yeah, he has like you can actually see that mustache. Like, yeah, it's pretty funny. It's um, literally the mustache is on point. Yeah, like, you see the little hairs. What I like is. I guess since maybe because I don't know, he sculpted differently or something, but his backboard, the fin, works as the base to help hold him up, which is pretty good. You know, a little extra support. I didn't even notice it. Yeah. Never hurt somebody. Some extra support's always good. Um, I like this one, and like I said before, Joker's my favorite. There is a Batman coming out too, guys. Um, if you look at the back of the box, uh, there is a Batman Surf Up that will be coming out soon. Joker just released before. Um, not sure what's going on there, but. I guess that's just how they do it. Thought they would have released them all together yeah. like they normally do, but stay tuned for that. Yep. Yeah. Um, next here we have uh, Captain Marvel. This is Captain Marvel Masked, which was a comic book shop exclusive. Yeah, only just, uh, just it was distributed to comic book shops. Yeah, that's the only thing um, about this pop. You couldn't go to any store to try to pick this up or anything like that. Yeah. This is something where you had to go to your local comic book shop and see if they had it or if, you know, they ordered it or anything like that. Yeah, you can't go to a Walgreens or a Walmart or any other to uh, store you go to to pick these up. because like, You can see a sticker in there in the front. Um, I got a little closer view for you guys. Yeah, it's GTS Distributors. So, they got their own, which is pretty cool. It's a good... So, there is list. the Captain Marvel where she's unmasked and then there's the exclusive where it's masked um what i like about it is like that mohawk she has going on the top yeah they, they popped it right through the mask it looks pretty dope um other than that i mean it looks like her it's a good pop no nothing wrong with the details yeah it's the old school comics i like a little the sash yeah. she has going on on the side that was pretty cool um here we have don't drop it don't drop it aquaman the patina i think that's how you pronounce it patina pop this is entertainment exclusive but Comic Con, you were able to purchase it online. I'm pretty sure it's still available for online uh, purchase, but it's the basic Aquaman pop that they made for Batman vs Superman statue. So I want to paint call it painted like a statue. Um, it's probably because he's underwater. I mean, he looks like a like a rustic statue that's been there for so long. Looks like um, Statue of Liberty. Yeah, you got that that green going on because you can tell like the the copper's rusting out. Um, you see his beard. The only difference between this pop and the original one, you don't see his tattoos or his eyebrows, obviously, because that's all painted. He's just a statue. Um, but yeah, it's the same as the Aquaman that came out, like I said, but just painted. So his box is identical with just the entertainment nurse sticker on it. Um, I pre-ordered this as soon as I saw that it was available for pre-order because I think it's still available. Um, yeah, you can still pick it up on entertainmentnurse.com. Um, Check it out, guys. I mean, it is a nice pop. The details are good. Yeah. Um, for a pop that's supposed to look like a statue, it's on point. Yeah, it gets the job. So done. that's, you know, if that's what you're looking for, that's what you want, boom, there it is, you have it. Yeah. Um, over here we have Buttercup. This is um, Comic-Con exclusive. This one we got does have the original Comic-Con sticker. It is kind of coming off. Um, oh, I guess it wasn't an <laughs> adhesive that great. Uh, so this is Buttercup from Powerpuff Girls, um, Cartoon Network show. Yeah. They did come out with um, Blossom and, and Butter Bubbles. Bubbles. Um, those were all together. Those came out as well. Um, it's a great little pop. It's yeah. on a clear little base. Base. Does it feel good? Yeah. It uh, punches in. It has little pegs for them to go right in. You were able to get this one at Hot Topic, but they flew. They flew faster than any of the other Hot Topic ones. Yeah, they flew and the prices flew yeah, up like, too. <laughs> you're going to pay like 30, 30 bucks each. And... I would have liked that they would have made her more angry because if you guys know about the Powerpuff Girls, Buttercup was always the mad one. But it, oh well, I mean it's still it's still pretty nice. Um, Maybe that's another exclusive. That's what I was thinking. Maybe they'll do an exclusive. Isn't there like um, a villain that's like really big or something like that? That, that the monkey. I don't remember his name. Uh, he was a monkey. 
Yeah. Well, I mean, we got it for a good deal, and that's why we picked yeah. it up. Comic Con um, sticker. We we need that Comic Con sticker. That that helped uh, pull the trigger on that. Yeah, that was for sure. But yeah, she's pretty nice. Um, here we got Dagobah Yoda. Um, this one released recently out of the blue. Um, it's like the the Yoda pop, but he has white on the back of his his hair, so it shows how much older he really is. Because we all know Yoda's pretty pretty darn old. Um, we couldn't just say old man Yoda. They could have, they could have, <laughs> but I guess because Dagobah is the planet he lived in in his final years, whatever. Um, it's not an exclusive, but it's not on the back. Yeah. So I, we don't know what the deal is. Insert emoji icon. We don't know what the deal is, but um, but yeah, he's pretty cool. You can see he's like older because his green is faded. He's yeah, not as green. he has wrinkles. Yeah, and white hair. But then so, again, it's. it's Highlights. It's white highlights, guys. It, right. show, it shows experience. Um, he has a little king going on. It would have been cool if he still had his lightsaber. That's how it is. A bobblehead, like you guys know yeah. how Star Wars are. And on its Star Wars base. Um, but yeah, I picked this one up. We picked it up. Sorry. I'm going to correct myself. Got a little selfish. Sure, you're taking it away from me. See that, guys? I'm a little selfish. Caught it on video, though. Um, we that, picked it up because it was pretty cool. But yeah, we liked it. That was our pickups. Uh, tune in for our next one. Um, we will have another pickup video coming next week. Yep. Yeah. And don't forget, on Monday, we will have our Man Cave collection, which is, you know, a pops that we collected mm -hmm. as far as set. a whole set. So tune in for that too, guys. Yeah, stay tuned. Subscribe, like, comment. Do it all. Man Cave out.